They were loud. Loud enough to stop the toughest abortion measure from passing in the state of Texas. Senate Bill 5, if passed, would have shut down the majority of abortion clinics in Texas, including clinics in the Rio Grande Valley. The women in the valley would have to travel all the way to San Antonio, the closest one that we, we believe that would meet the requirements and the standards. Patricio Gonzalez with Planned Parenthood says the protesters' efforts send a message to Texas lawmakers. Well, it says that Texans have said enough is enough. They, they did not want this to be voted on. But supporters of the bill, including Senator Eddie Lucio Jr., says the bill is meant to enhance women's health care. It's just a difference of opinion. Uh, a lot of people felt that um, we were violating women's rights. I felt in the opposite. I felt that we were also being very considerate. The bill would have banned abortions after 20 weeks, call for upgrades to facilities making them surgical centers, and require doctors who perform abortions to have admitting privileges to a hospital within 30 miles. All this bill was is a backdoor plan to ban abortion, plain and simple. The bill was voted on but not in time to be signed. Unfortunately, um, we ran out of time, and uh, even though we started to vote on the bill. The so-called people's filibuster sent a message across the state and the country. A woman, her doctor, and her faith should be making her medical decisions, not a politician.